All right, hello and welcome to the stream. Let's fix up this audio, make sure it's not too loud. All right, now we're good to go. I think we're good. We're good. Wait a minute. Not quite. Uh. All right. Very good. All right, so it's been a little while since I played, so I kind of remember the mechanics, but we'll jump back into it. All right, I guess we don't know how to read. We know how to make a sword, but we don't know how to read. All right. Ah, yes, that's right. Ooh. Oh, come on. Oh, I guess it was. Thank goodness for that. This is just loading in. Alright, so we found. Uh... Alright, we got a couple of debuffs. Have a look. We ate too much and we're. What's that mean? Uh... Oh, yeah, because we broke out of jail. That's right. Uh, and ate too much food. So our stats are basically nil at the moment. See if we can find some way to just sleep for a while. The reputation. Rovna doesn't raid us. Tamburg. I don't know what that even means. It's a uh, moon smiling with eyes closed emoji. Scarlet loves us. I guess it's out of 100, but maybe you can go down to negative 100 or something. All right, that's a. Uh, I was gonna say let's see if we can find a bed, but I don't think this is quite the nicest place to go to bed. Ooh, nice pretzel on a dead man. I like that you can loot all of them. Pretzel. All right, so we got. You missed the grave. Goodness gracious. Alright, so we got this building. I'm not sure if we can get in. I can't remember. Oh yes, that's right. I was just trying to quick save, but we can't quick save in this game. Punch this door open. Alright. A little shed. And another unopenable door, sure. Alright, so we got our map. We're at Rovna. We came from Talmberg, but I think they still hate me at Talmberg because something, I was going to say, something bugged out, but that's how this game works, right? Okay. I like how you can, like, see the basic layout of the town, and then you can zoom in and actually get the proper layout. Now at the big church. What, like a logging camp? Some farms. Let's go check out this farm, shall we? Not me else we might be able to find a bed to have a nap. Ooh, nice lightning. I just want to make sure all my settings are higher because this game has this has beautiful graphics. Oh yeah, I need the DLC. The HD. Yeah. That's all fine. Advanced graphics settings, here we go. Yeah, look at that. We're not on max graphics at all. Let's see how this handles it. Physics, you gotta have high physics. Motion blur off though. Alright, so this might. Okay, let's make you no know, ultra, let's just go high. Very high. Because I mean, I only have a 1060 in here, so I'm not sure if it's quite future tech yet. Alright. So this might take a little bit to load. And the hard drive I'm playing this off doesn't, it's not the fastest hard drive in the world, so. <clears throat>
loading screen loading screen the game. Ah, big day of work. Cut up a bunch of onions. Stay back half an hour to keep cutting up onions because we've got a farmer's day at work tomorrow. Luckily I'm not working, I just get to go in and with the farmer's day we're also having a sausage sizzle. Man, I had a lot of trouble saying sausage sizzle quickly today. And every time I'd be able to say it. I have to slim myself down, sausage sizzle, sausage sizzle, sausage sizzle. But, yeah. So I got to cut up all the onions for that because... I was in produce and of course um, I guess we're the ones who do cut up all the other vegetables so I had to cut up about seven kilos of onions but it's good because I got to practice my knife skills because I want to practice to be a better cook and so the only way you get faster at chopping things is by chopping things I did all right I didn't manage to cut myself this time which is nice last time when was it no, oh, it was only yesterday. Was it? No, it must have been Sunday. I had work on Monday. I don't think it was Sunday. Anyway, yesterday or the day before. Uh, needed to use up some leftover ingredients from previous things that I cooked last week. So I put together the, the basic French base thing where you chop up some onions, some carrots, some celery and cook it nice and slow so it just uh, dissolves and then I put some pumpkin in, some tomato in, a bit of water and spices and some nice peppers made into a, a spicy pumpkin and tomato soup and that came out really nice. Been eating that for about three days now. Just finished it off t for dinner this evening. Alright, sorry I just got this, I don't know if the camera can see it, but I got a black spot in my thumb. Now I've just noticed it and it's annoying me so I'm going to take it out. It's not like putting anybody out by picking at it anyway. I must have stepped... Oh yeah, but as I was saying, so I was making my soup. And to do your soup, you gotta... or to do the... that base, the French base. You need to chop up your celery, carrots your onion real small so I was practicing that I managed to cut myself about twice doing it the onions I chopped up today weren't quite as small as the ones I did yet for my soup but I should do it rather quickly without cutting myself at all so bully me was it what's the same bully for me bully to me don't bully me that wouldn't be nice Oh goodness, this thing is deeper than I thought it was. I think I remember doing it too, but I don't remember why. Or when it happened. I remember it happening and I'm like, oh. I'll have to dig into my thumb to take that out at some point and here we go. I'm not squeamish about picking into my own fingers to get out splinters and the like. I know some people are, but if it's in there and I can get it out. I'll just dig it out. And then tweezers, let's use some proper tools. And my proper tools, I mean my knife. I've done it. Feels like I'm grabbing it, but it's not coming out. I 
It's like if I get a mosquito bite, I'll just scratch it until I scratch the head off, get all that poison out, and sure, it scabs up, but... That's not itchy anymore. I was going to say I think I got it, but not quite. I think I got most of it at least. Yeah. There we go. Alright, back to the game. Oh, let's finish loading. Let's see how this runs. I mean, it's running. Oh, we got the frame rate. I saw something. Show FPS. There we go. Uh, yeah. Uh, I mean, about 30 FPS is all you can hope for, isn't it? With two by high settings, also running a stream, also this and also that. Wasn't expecting 120 FPS. Look at that. If I'm looking straight down, I get I can almost get 45 FPS. I mean. Dried mushrooms, I don't, I don't know about that. If I look straight up, I can even get 60. Look at that. It's just when I look at all the grass around and stuff. Uh, I don't think that was my horse. I can't remember. Uh, so I want to turn to the left here and check along the right fork. There we go. I, I don't know if I have a weapon. There we go. We do have a sword. I can't remember how to pull it out. Do I have a sword? Main hand. I don't have anything equipped, I guess. Uh, that's... There. Oh, so I guess I had two of them? Yeah. Cool. So I may as well have a bludgeon. Do we have anything to put on? I guess we're wearing stuff already. Got some stolen gloves. Stolen in Talmberg. I guess might have been what I got arrested for. I mean, all my clothes, they says they're dirty, but it's pouring with rain, so... How dirty can it be? Uh... 79%. <clears throat> we got a bit of food on us. I don't know how... Ah, that's right, you can save like this. I got seven of them, but you can also save and quit. And that, stop, that stops you from save scumming. Um, I mean, I've still got five days, five days left, so I'll be right. You got a few of each. Uh, nourishment, we're way over full. I think a hundred is what you want to get for, get to. That's why we're so. That's our little piggy symbol. So, I mean, I was hoping for some rest, but. Kill Skaker. Pull the blood. Ooh, this is PUBG. Fuck off. I just wanted to jump over it. I wasn't expecting vaulting mechanics. Rip. Rip and pepperonis. Is that any good? Ah, oh, I can't pick it up. Right, the apple core. I can't even pick up the apple core. Anything good still around? Anything left unburnt? Nah. Can't get the fire going. Good thing, uh... Moisture isn't a mechanic in this game. Ah, oh, we can gather some thistle. Oh, jeez, cutscene. Ooh, cutscene worthy, huh? Ah, oh, that's right, I had this sword. Can I... Oh, I can equip it. Um, R? E? I can't remember how to get my weapon out. V? Yep, C is crouch. I think that's cool horse. F? Oh, it's still raining. It's nice. Alright, let's uh... 
Before we get into a fight, let's see if we can figure out how weapons work, shall we? Ah, one and two. And two, I don't think we have a ranged weapon. And a sheath out sword. I get mad at us. Oh, but I've been watching this game. Oh, I've seen a trailer for a game. How do they make a house you can't get inside? Um, I think it's called. Yeah, that's right. It's called Scum. Well, I got to it from looking at scum interface games. And uh, it looks a lot like Rust or PUBG in a way. Just sit. Oh, I got a buff for sitting on the toilet. This is buff. Uh, but it involves moisture as a survival thing where like if you go in the water you need to put your clothes by the fire so they dry off. Oh yeah, so <laughs> it's a good place to a good place to sit and read a book. Oh the rain set back in again. Oh, that was a little bit of respite. But yeah, so you can get wet and then you can like die of the cold. I mean, loot anything. This isn't a bed, this is like a. Uh, not a bed, this isn't a house, it's like a cell. Uh, metal, I guess. Cool. I mean, it's kind of odd that there's a cutscene for everything you pick up. But, uh. Let's see. Let's, I guess it's in other. Uh, well, I don't know what it does, but I got it. Maybe I can sell it. I mean, I can make some thistle. I, theoretically, I can make some thistle tea. Or even nettle tea. Is there something harvestable? Nope. Oh, that's cool. They're all blowing in the rain. That's a neat little thing. Let's save that. I'm in a private area. I mean, I think the owner's up at the uh, church, so I'm not sure if they're going to come. I'm not sure if they're going to worry too much about me being in their house. What's this one? Valyrian. Oh, it looks like some sort of dandelion or something. Ah, oh, man. That... Oh, I <laughs> leveled up in herbalism. Cool. See if I actually I think you can spend a skill point in it now or something. Uh skills herbalism. More herb. Cool. Oh we gotta point at level five. And then we can spend that on flower power. Uh we smell nice and so people like us more. Our horse <laughs> likes us more if it's got things. I'm still for better and. Leg day. Can't skip leg day. Ah, uh, must be like a manger or something. There's other stuff we can't pick, but. Not lots more thistle! Saw the orange flower out in the fields. Poppies. Nice poppies count as nice smelling. We got some dandelions. <laughs> Just out in the middle of a raining field, picking flowers. I want to check. Wait, what was that? Wormwood. Ah, oh, where are I learned wormwood from? That's from Harry Potter. Was it? I say it's marigold. Yep. You know, it smells so nice. Elves, poppies, sheepskin. That's, I mean, three, three somethings. We can we? It says it'll get handy when the weather gets cold. I think it's pretty cold now. All right. Me. I don't want to get a fire going. I mean, I could take that axe, couldn't I? 
make a neat old weapon. Another house. I don't think drinking is a thing. Alright. Oh, this isn't a private area. Just another one. Alright, we got options to sleep and save. No food laying around, but. I can't. Oh! I'm on a quest! That's right! I need to get back to my town! <laughs> run off some of this nourishment shall we? What else do we have in this town though? So that was all burnt out. I don't know what that is. That could be like a sheep pen or something. Let's head up over the bridge, continue off to the north. Check out any houses that we come, come by just in case. We got something cool in them, but that's a lot of poppies. Can we stop and pick it all? We can. We can stop and pick anything. Jeez. Oh. Hey. Oh. Oh, jeez. Okay, so... Let him go to sound. Give up your weapon and you can go. What's to be done? Give up your weapon. Thank you. Wait, what? Can I can I take his Oh, um Did it make me bled out? Can we compare it to ours? Let's have a look. We got a bassinet. Can we put the coif on underneath our bassinet? And it's not looking too good. We got fat foot wraps and soles. Gives us one armor. What are we wearing? We are wearing old boots, which are also one armor. Another jerk and light gambeson. Added quarter jacket. Yeah, you got light padded armor. I wonder if it takes the same slot though. Uh, so let's grab that, let's grab that. Patched hose, we have tight hose. Hey, hey, hey. Um, so I guess, yeah, he like bled out. And wrecked him. Uh, I guess we're encumbered. I guess what that buff meant. Overloading. Okay, cool. Uh, so let's check this out. So we got a green shirt. What are we wearing? A body garment. Light padded armor, I guess. The gambeson can replace it. It's not quite as good. We got a jerk in which we can equip. Cool. We don't need this shirt. So we can drop that. We don't need this armor anymore, although we could sell it for some good money. We got some scarf, which we can put on instead of our Waffenrock. Waffenrock? So we can switch that out for just a scarf. One armor, or one armor. Nah, that's alright. Let's just drop the skill off. Now we for weight. 74. Okay, so we're alright for weight now. Couple bludgeons, but what weighs us down the most? I guess it's light padded armor. Let's just drop it. Um. Oh, I guess our sword is. dirty? I guess it's like a bloody sword, so people think, hey, you stabbed somebody. It's fine. There, the seeks. 
that's what he was holding, that's what I wanted. Now originally a hunter's weapon, finish shot prey, short sword, burgers. Uh, and then one sharp and it is unsuited to stabbing. Not good for stabbing, not good for blocking. 18, 33, 9 compared to 45, 40. No, thank you. It's blunt damage, so it doesn't do well against armor. 33 defense compared to 40 defense. Alright, so. Our left click is like a. A quick swing, and I think a right click is. Uh, how do I block again? Controls. Q. Special attack itch is a, a, a kick, or a tackle, or a stealth. Is there a button to clean my weapon? Gee, surrender. I should probably remember that one. We got sharpening. Oh, what is it? Oh. Some dirty rags. No time to lose. All right. I mean, I didn't know he was a bandit. I was gonna talk to him. Just running through the fields. It's just a rock here. Oh, got my toesies wet. I wasn't expecting a stream. I was just having a look at what this was. Something out of no, yeah. I guess it must be something out of town. Just a, maybe it's like a hay bale. Oh, well. is that possible? No. no it's just run by the stream. There's a little bridge. Oh, that's a cute little bridge. Just a few logs, a bit of a handrail. Alright, I'm ready. Oh, he's just a dude. It's... I guess that X means... Please don't eat it. So this isn't soldiers, I guess it's people killed by soldiers. Sweet Jesus. It's the charcoal burn. <laughs> Doesn't have like a letter on him saying, If I die, my secret treasure is buried. That's a dude that's been hanged. No, I actually want my sword out after all. Sweet Jesus, it's the charcoal burner's his wife. Yeah. Yeah, look at the toesies. Just smoldering even in this rain. Ow. Right. Yeah, I don't come any mud. Oh, I kind of like wash myself in a stream or something. All right, here's the town. Ah, oh, that's right. We've like we got to go back for our father. Father! What did these poor souls ever do to them? Oh my! Oh, wait, bandage, I think. Cool. 
I knew it'd be worth checking out these bodies. Just tearing off strips of their dresses. Okay, so... No, no quick travel. Don't be ridiculous. So here's the town. There's a little thing outside, then a gate. Farmers in the fields up to the northeast. That was our house, I think. No, our house was... That was the dude's house. Then our house was in here, that's right. There's our little forge. Uh, yep. Is that Kelly, Tony, Long, Sean? So, nice little homestead out right up the main road up the hill. Ah, wash yourself. Ah, wash yourself as much as we can in that trough. Let's have a look at our clothes. Alright, we're not soiled anymore. 100%! Is that what that means? Uh, I guess it just means... I don't know if they have like a... Oh, there's no way to... I'll wash the butt off my sword, can I? Get my sword in the water. No, I guess we just have a bloody sword now. I don't think I have a lockpick. Oh, we do. Uh, how do I do this again? Check out the help. So, hold E. That's right. Rotate the whole thing. Okay. Easy. Oh, I guess I wasn't able to quick travel here. A cabbage. Oh, so we like. Oh, that's cool. So when you rob, it's like a pile of stuff, and then he like overturns it when you rob it, so they can tell that it was has been sifted through. I mean, I may as well. It's at 100% freshness. Oh, there's five of them. Um, I'm going to close it behind us, but you know, that'll do. And of course the gateway is destroyed. Vault! Damn it. So it wants us to get into town. There is another gate on the northeast and also the north. Cool. 
Just follow the road around. Oh, that's cool. Maybe it gets grayscale when you spent too much. It's like, uh, can you actually pass out? Can't do anything actually. I was trying to like punch while also out of breath. Um. I wonder if these bushes actually mask us. Are you looking this way? Get how to get him. No, screw you. Is this an ordinary tar padded black coif? Nine defense, jeez. That's only six. Oh, and it's a separate armor slot. What do we have? We got. Heck yeah. 77.6. Nah, so I guess our Gambeson isn't really worth using now, but may as well keep it on. That was my loot. Yes, we get a Groshan. A whole Groshan. Uh, head on in. Oh, jeez. You didn't run like me. The guy with a sword in his hand. I will take your sword for you, Mr. Bailiff. Yep. It's a shard. 43 compared to my 45. Uh. Once someone's pro enjoy the short sword is now an old relic, they won't take too much rough treatment. The point is practically worn off, though the blade is reasonably honed. So it's a better slashing than that's the weight. I'm gonna drop this six and these bludgeons. For the next person that comes into town. They could think he died with a six in his hand. Cool ripples. <laughs> you looking at me? You stood by your side and you did this to you. In the end, you were a hero. You didn't run away. Oh God, get out of like yourself. Mother! No bandages on anyone, jeez. 
Mother! And we're gonna find our father's body isn't there. <gasps> oh, ma! It's a lot of arrows. Mother! Unless they died together. Why did you do it to me, Father? Not leave what? him. Why did you leave me? Forgive me for everything. Next time I won't run. I'll never run away He's again. Like sticking his head into his mother. I'll find the one who did this to you. I remember his face. I'll find him. Kingdom come deliverance to kingdom with a vengeance. First, I have to find this shovel and. Are well, you going to bury everyone in town? I can bury him in the home. I remember you told me you wanted to lie beside Mother. Here. Under the linden tree. At least I can do that much for you. Oh, oh. All right. <laughs> Y'all good? Loot. <laughs> Let's find a spade. Puppy! Puppy! A person? Need to get a shovel. Get away, you must! Oh, right, the doggy. Get away, you beast! What's going on? This shack. What in God's name are you doing? What do you think I'm doing? Digging turnips? The beast just went for me. Isn't that not the butchers? Oh, Isn't that body the butchers? Yeah, that's no, he's just protecting his master. What's that got to do he's with being that? a good dogger. I'd say the poor creature is standing guard over his master. You weren't trying to get to him, were you? What do you care what I'm doing? Yeah, dude, how did you survive? What are you doing? Uh, I think we just have to be threatening. I asked what you're doing here. Yes. How about you give me an answer? If I want to confess, I'll go to the priest. Go away and leave me in peace. Oh jeez, he has a lot higher combat than me though. I don't know how he succeeded. Do you know what happened to Teresa from the mill? When I fled, the Cuman wanted to me. They meant to violate her. God knows what else. No. Jeez, dude. What do I care? They probably raped her and killed her like all the others. Her misfortune. Right now, I've got to be careful. Oh, jeez, dude. Did you lend me that spade? I have to dig a grave. I can't find another. What's it worth to you? I see you have a I'll sword. give you my sword. I'll gladly trade you my spade for that. How did you come by it, anyway? 
My father forged it for Sir Radzik. It's my duty to deliver it to him. Uh uh uh. Uh uh uh. See how that. And where will you dig it anyway? Here. You're not going to lay your parents in unhallowed ground, are you? Father said he wanted to. He is a piece of shit, but. God willing, later I can find a priest to consecrate the ground. How did you manage to get away? How do you think? And I ran. <laughs> Jeez, dude. Oh, the punching. Goodness gracious. I suck at my own fighting this game. Oh, jeez. Oh, 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 oh. Come on, buddy. Put my sword. Yeah, there we go. Get him. Get him. What's this injured torso? Oh, I guess we have a point to spend in strength. I think that's what that means. For these, I can get blocking. Yeah, let's just carry more. Just like, hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh, I guess I'm not bleeding yet. I mean, we're almost leveled up. Um, is there a Unarmed combat. Uh, I 
characters, sorry about this. no no no. Maybe in here? There's something to teach us how to fight properly, because I mean I'm just like wailing on him. Okay, let's have a look at this first. I guess they can be angry, neutral, or happy. Nice food and poisoning. Horse arms equipment. Gee. So we've got wounds and healing. You get a healing potion. Ah, oh, so that must have been what happened to that dude was he bled out. But, uh, oh, I don't know. I'll just keep going on, shall we? That's right. Turn tail and run, you bastard. Alright, I guess, I guess we beat him. Hey, Dogger. Hey. Easy there, boy. No. You're a good master. Easy, boy, easy. He's, um. So, my clicking on things doesn't work anymore for whatever reason. Look. Here's some cheese. You're right, Papa, you're right. That's not what I meant to do. Little cheese. Uh, no. Hey, what's this on the map? Oh, I guess just drag out, drag my parents' bodies. Uh, okay, so clicking doesn't work anymore. Hair yeah, skin, that's right. Uh, I want to dig a grave. Hey guys, see ya! Just casually stomp over their bodies. Oh yeah, it's a nice tree. I wouldn't mind being buried under it. Ah, so I guess our uh, abilities are coming back slowly as well. I'm off. This is a good place. You're gonna like it. Alright, so that dude's definitely gonna. Aww, Papa!
He's coming to get the shovel back. I mean, he's just like constantly talking to his father, with the mother right there as well. It's all about father. You're being such a pussy boy. Damn it all. Now man up, dude. Do you need some help? Is oh shit. Help? Yes. Can't you see the sword? Who are you? What do you want? Spishek? Oh. Franciscan brothers. It's a big old club. Ah, there we go. That's why it's a quest I item. Especially that fine blade that's of no use to a peasant like you anyway. Banish the thought. It is my father's sword. You mean him? I don't think he's going to be needing it anymore. Listen here, boy. No way. Hand over that sword. I might just let you go. If not, you're in for a family reunion you really don't want. Leave me alone. I cut the bastard down. As you like. Could have just cost you a few teeth. Okay, I was not going to let me do the fight. I'm ready. Is it, I guess? Okay. Yeah. I mean, of course it was none. I told you how it would end. You should have listened to me. This is nice work. The chief is going to like it. It's a it's you, isn't it? I mean, I've already now, killed like two people in the way. The maiden bloodletting. Surely you I mean, have like another sword in my pocket. I oh, thank God, Zabishek. I believe there's a word for such moments. The old man would certainly know. All right. But I'm just a common kid. Did you help make it? No doubt you did. Such miserable luck. You can crack across the back Die of the head. The sword you Ooh. Forge. Hey, <laughs> it's a dramatic pose. Is it Sabishek's girlfriend? Ah. The games are over. Run with the sword though. Parted with Sir Redzig's sword. Is that? I guess it's Sir Redzig. The sword's for him, so. Is it Sir Redzig? I hope so. I mean, you have bloody eye, eye. You only took a, a light tap by a bludgeon. Ah, uh, it's. Type ready for Kingdom Come Deliverance.
Ah, uh, at least they buried him for us. What about it? Mother! Why they just leave her? Oh, this is the dude from the castle we went to, right. Ah, uh, Brian Blessed is in this game. Oh, awesome. <laughs> like recently, he called a farmer's association a bunch of cunts because they wanted to kill badgers. Peter Samick and Peter Janik. Half past ten. How long have I been live for? I've been live for an hour. It felt like twenty minutes. You know, it's a good game when you've been live. <laughs> playing it for an hour, it feels like twenty minutes. Papa, he's a good puppy. Now still doesn't hate me. <laughs> right, me interested. Hey, there's that boss that stole those boots. Valsky. It's a nice last name, I like that. You're just parading us through town. Yeah, the facial expressions in this game. I guess the game might now open up a oh jeez. Uh I don't think we're bleeding, right? Who's who's yelling? Hey. going just running oh jeez you need some help? Oh, he's like doing any flashbacks yes What a huge army for just taking out a little village. Oh, cool transitions. Yes. Henry. Shut up, mother, you're dead. for the big loading screen because it's loading the next part of the game. Maybe that thing was a test. It's like you're meant to stand and fight and try to defend rather than just run away. Never wake. 
Yeah. You're having a nightmare? Uh, Teresa? Hmm. Just have a fever. Uncle won't be pleased, but you'll have to stay in bed. <laughs> she even unlocked fat, sir. Be stuffed to bursting for two days. <laughs> I guess while I was passed out. Where am I? In Scalitz? We're at my uncle's near the I didn't know where else to go. What happened? You don't remember anything? I suppose that's. Oh, gee, she's a bit dirty. I found you in Scalitz after those bandits attacked you. I thought they'd done for you. But you were still breathing. Why in heaven's name did you go back there? It was madness. We slaughtered everyone who didn't run. My parents, I, I wanted to bury them. I had to... Don't worry. I took care of it. Thank you. Any good Christian would have done the same. Now sleep. You need your strength back. Still stuffed to bursting. It's near midnight. You've slept all day. Oh. <laughs> oh, I feel like a horse fell on me. The beating you took was worse. But at least the fever's broken. <laughs> Damn, girl. Waiting to die. What? They killed my brothers, my family, my friends. They're all dead. All of them. Everyone I ever loved. They killed one of my brothers in the mines. After that, what did I have to live for? Don't say that. There's always hope. No, there isn't. Thank goodness. But it doesn't matter. I'm a different person now. How did you manage to save me? You were lucky. I was in Scalitz and I saw Zbyshek and his thugs. I tried to distract them, but it would have been no use if those soldiers from Tamburg hadn't arrived. Okay, they were so they were for me anyway. The bandits. Searching for me? Yes. Lord Divish sent them, led by Captain Robard. So tell me, why is a lord of such high standing interested in a blacksmith? So Divish promised Sir Radzik he'd look after me. Well, that's for why they should care. I have no idea. Mm. Oh, I'm not surprised. I'll bring you water and something to eat. In the meantime, rest. <laughs> Go back to sleep for another week. Good morning to you. How's the invalid today? I uh, haven't felt as good as this since they lashed me to the wheel and quartered me on the town square. Got your sense of humour back. You must be better. My uncle will be glad to hear it. I had a job persuading him to let me bring you here. If he'd lain around much longer, he really would have dumped you on the town square. You can stay until you find somewhere else to live, but my uncle will want payment for taking you in and caring for you. And this is your uncle's house? We're in Rete Mill. My uncle's Miller Peshek. He took me in, and I talked him into taking care of you, too. I've been lying here long enough. Uncle will be pleased he's one mouth less to feed. But are you truly well enough? Well enough to do what has to be done. Where can I find Sir Ratzik? Jeez, he's in the old dude. Time. He's a guest of Sir Hannes of Leiper. But someone like you can't just walk up bold as you please and demand an audience. I know, Sir Radzik, and I didn't bring him his sword. Didn't they cut the bandits down? Or was one of them able to run faster than a... to my uncle first. You've been in your sick bed for over a fortnight while he paid the apothecary to tend to you. And the medicine. That's a good deal of coin you owe. I've been lying here two weeks. Oh my God. Better a fortnight in bed than an eternity in the grave. If it weren't for my uncle... Oh, you're my life, yeah. The good thief? I owe you both my life, and I'll repay my debt. You have my word. All right. <clears throat> but before you go to town, you should eat something. You're still right. weak. There's food on the table. You go see. Uh, 
gonna sit wherever we want and have our own trunk. Cool, 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 cool. Alright, so where the heck are we? Jeez, we're on the other side of the damn world! We got main quests. So we got what two, three quests. All uh, right, yes. Ah, so we got to get Father's sword back. Oh, geez, that's like that's a very big goal. Get Father's sword back, and you know, find the dude who killed our parents and avenge them. What is it? First of all, I have to find the boss who stole the sword for me. Nickname Runt. Something to do with Zabishik. Let's find Mark Fort. Not from Bad Dreams. Freezes, Rishi. Cool, cool, cool. And let's go chat. Where's our trunk? Alright. The good thing I kept that shard, huh? Now, how do I repair my stuff? How's this stuff looking? Oh, I guess it's still alright. We have nourishment food in us, shall we? Uh, Cool. Sixteen bandages, jeez. Uh, just one lock pick. Oh, I have a torch in our offhand. Uh, drop an apple into the pot. We could, we could steal for our. We're just in the mill. A door? Looks like a little doorway. So from what I've seen of this, these these buildings are like accurate as heck. Buddy! Oh, oh, oh. Walk through me. Okay, let's have a chat. My name's Henry. Thank you for taking care of me. Oh, he sounds My name's mad. Eshek, and I'm the miller here. You've oh, he's bad. She took care of you for two whole weeks while you were in limbo. And talking of you being at death's door. While you were lying here, you worked up quite a bill with the blood letter. Who came now and again to keep you alive with his potions. That quack doesn't come cheap. I paid him what I could, but I still... That is, you still owe him. I see. Well, it's better to be in debt than to lie dead in a ditch. What do I owe? I'm not afraid of hard work. You won't pay for that shoveling. Quests. I might have a better job for you. When it's not something any fool can do. If you prove to me you're a clever lad, I might trust you with something you could really. Of course. What do you say? Well, what would you need from me? 
A trifle. Oh, uh, just to take on, something from someone and bring it to someone else. And not get caught while you're doing it. That sounds straightforward enough. Except for not get caught. Why would anyone want to catch me? Oh, don't worry. It's just a job like any other. Jeez, he's really starting us off strong, huh? Let's say the right moral disposition. Do corpses bother you? No honourable man should touch them. That's the executioner's job. Did you expect I'd give you a hoe and send you out to the fields? You can dig all right, but somewhere else. I want to know whether you're going to hide behind some stupid fucking scruples, or if you might be useful yeah, sure. for unconventional work. I was prepared for just about anything, but that's a bit much. But go on, tell me more. Listen, it's about this ring my mate Wojcik, the Kohelnitz Miller, had his eye on. Hey, as long as he was a buried the ring villain. By gibbet, along with the villain. <laughs> Cursing himself. Jesus Christ. You want me to dig up a corpse, take a ring from it, and give it to your friend in Kohelnitz? It's Jeez, nothing sacred okay. to you. Money first, morals later. That fellow is dead. He won't miss it. Whatever bleeding heart came up with the idea that it's disrespectful to disturb a corpse, never read the Bible. It's still a human body. Only it's missing a soul. Why yeah. are you disgusting you know. something created by God? I think I've already heard more than I need to know. <laughs> You've got the tongue of the devil himself. <laughs> you fight hard enough, I bet you could justify sodomy with a goat. Watch your mouth. Can get... There's a shovel here around the mill somewhere. If there's any problem, come and see me. Uh, potion or some food? To make you dig better. Thanks. I'll need it. I can't believe I've come to this. Digging up corpses. Oh, and uh, watch out for the executioner and his hounds. They're pretty savage. And I don't just mean the dogs. You can just throw them some meat. The dogs, that is. But the executioner? Spirits. Well, don't vex him. I kind, of, I kind of don't really want to... do it. Just because, you know... I need a wash, girl. Have you eaten yet? I oh, she left a pie for us, right? Yes, it was very good. Did you bake it yourself? I did. Is that I'm all? Glad you enjoyed it. Uh. What are you up to? How would you like to um? I don't know. Come for a walk? A walk? I'd like that very much. Yeah. But I can't right now, Hal. Give me some time to settle in, will you? If I just want to go for a walk, to have a chat. It's not you, Hal. It's just this isn't a good time. I'd like to know... How are the Scallets folk getting on? They're alive. That's the main thing. They have shelter, but they're just scraping by. Rattay's citizens aren't happy the town is full of beggars who don't look like leaving anytime soon. Do you know anything about those human rapists? No. About... No. They came to Hungary from God knows where, and now they... Well, folk tell awful stories about them. I hope I never see them again. So, how do you like it in that time? It's a big town with good strong walls, so I suppose we're safe here. And they took us in in our hour of need, but... How much longer? All right. Grow tired of us soon enough. That's all. Have you got a moment? I'd like to ask a few questions about Scallops. I don't remember much. Oh, jeez. All right. What do you want to know? <laughs> Miller in the background. Grumbling under his breath, but not How did you get me away from Scallops? Don't know where I'm talking. Easy. So Robard and his men helped load you on a wagon and we harnessed an old nag the bandits had left behind. The soldiers escorted us all the way here. One of them got away. What about the bandits? I can't see Bishek. So Robard and his men routed them. Oh. They killed the few, but the Bishek so is going down. So with him. It won't be safe in Scallets for a while yet. Why would Bishek do that? I never thought much of him, but banditry. He was always a nasty piece of work. 
Doesn't surprise me he joined them. Oh. If you knew what he did to me. Tell me. When those humans they call them, when the humans came, Zabishek pushed me out in front of them and fled. He sacrificed me to save his own hide. Ah, uh, so. Where's the sword? I didn't have a horse. You had a sword? It's gone now. Those scum took everything, <laughs> including your horse. I don't give a damn about the horse. I stole it anyway. But my father forged that sword for Sir Radzik. I promised father I'd take it to him. I have to get it back. Well, you can't. Just be thankful you're still alive. What happened to the other survivors from Scalitz? They sought refuge in Ratei. And some of the Ratei folk are none too happy about it. And Matthew, Fritz, and Matthias? Not sure. Hanka, did they make it? They're alive. I heard Matthias is at the stud farm in Merhoyed. Johanka is in Sasau, and Fritz and Matthew, well, you know them. Don't That's good to hear. Somewhere. The only trouble they'll be in is of their own making. What about Sir Radzig? Sir Hanush, he's the Lord of Rete. He gave his lower castle to Sir Radzig, a place called Perkstein. Sir Hanush lives at the upper castle. The Scarlet's folk have made camp in front of it. How did you get away from those Cumans? You're wrong. If it hadn't been for you. When they came to the mill, they slaughtered everyone. And kept me for last. After you distracted them, I fled to the mines to find my brother, but he... My brother was dead, but I owe my life. And Aww, you that's cute. I owe mine to you. The scales are balanced. I won't try right. anymore. Let's leave it be. Uh, where'd dude go? Chat with him about actually just paying instead of. There he is. Hey, dude. Hey, dude. Uh. How much? Can you tell me? What about the Scalitz folk? God sent them to punish us for our sins. They don't work, they just idle around. I mean, I'm a skeleton folk. And you want to keep a close eye on your belongings when they're around. I'll be glad to see the back of them. What do you think about everything that's happened? I don't concern myself with the doings of my betters. But this mess isn't good for business. Them two brothers should sort things out between themselves without dragging us into it. I don't give a damn who's king, but that usurper from Hungary has gone too far. Do you know anything about those Cumans? The heathen scum that Sigismund brought here. Why do you even ask? Thanks. You seem with your own two wise what they're capable of. Uh, That's all. Alright. Ah, oh, what a nice place. A water mill rather than a windmill. Mushrooms, cave mushrooms. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, yes, that's right. I got a skill point, didn't I? Uh, I got a main level skill point too. All right, so. So I can chat with women better. I'm dirty because I got my musk. Nah. Uh, you... Yeah, that's what's probably worth it. Uh, right, in speech. 
speech power points every fourth level up. Cool. So you got final offer, high born, high born. Uh, yeah, let's go high born. Have it. Cool. So I wonder how. Let's just try quick travel. Um, stop, stop. I guess we're quick traveling. No, we're in Tomberg. I hope I unlocked the quick travel back down south. I just wanted to see what it was like. Alright, I'll let it prick quickly. What have we got here? He's getting sleepy, I guess. Oh, I can click again. That's nice. Yeah, okay. I don't know how much money do we have? Five. Hey, buddy. You're the young fellow who came here from Scarlet, half dead, aren't you? Oh, that's right, we made good favour with her. The lady of the castle was asking after you. She wants to talk to you. Ah, yeah. See you Thank you. Very well. Cool. Don't make a what? Way. I bumped into you. Chill, dude. What the hell? Hello, villager. Goodbye, villager. He's got an oddly low res face. Oh, uh, super mo- I uh, see what I knocked out, I remember. Villager. Villager. You right there, girl? Hey, Cookie! No, uh, let's talk trade. What do I have to sell? Ah, oh, so she'll only buy this sort of stuff. Ah, oh, good. Oh. That's right, I had a bed here, didn't I? Need a map. If it's still my bed. Speed her up? No. I'll go see my lady in the morning. Raining again. Um, this apple really doesn't give us much nourishment. It's fine, let's have just eat three whole cabbages. Hey, what's this in the. There was something up there. Alright, all of our clothes are dirty. Might be a 
trough. No. It's nice that our torch doesn't go out in the rain. Well, let's make ourselves look presentable, shall we? Leave the castle. In here, possibly? No, I'm not trespassing. That is private, my bad. There's no way to tell if areas are private or not. Um. Baker, our bed, a marina trader. Let's go visit the trader and come talk to Stephanie when she gets up. We nice to find a tailor. Uh, this one. Harbour? Was he the trader? God be with you. Cool. Can we trade? If you've got the coin. Uh, let's just sell all this. So we got we got a torch they were not using. Alright, what do you have to sell? Not much. Dried meat could be handy, not much. Nourishment, but lasts forever. One of these in. And what is it? Basket. Hagra. No. Can we do something about the price? Alright, so. I'm gonna get a bit more. Which one for me? Six. We agree. I'd almost We're about five. Sure. See now, I knew we'd come. It's a time. And yeah, it's just gone five. Is there something in town I could do? Is this shrine? An explored place. That's the uh Right, let's go to the unexplored place. So just head east from here. Just down here. Crunch. That's it. In here? Yes, cool. Beads! Oh, yeah, also. I guess I didn't unlock the quick travel, thank goodness. Uh, 
over here. It's not, I'm in a private area. What? What? Alright. Uh, what was that? Do I see a star? Best tipster. Tip tipster. Right, so south out this gate, across the bridge, and follow the path south. Here, across the bridge, and then right across the bridge here. Oh, I can head down this way and then across the bridge over there instead. Thank you! I was gonna quick save and kill the pig just to see if I could, but then I remembered there's no quick save in this game. Hello, lady! Hey! Hey, wait, come back! Hey! Hey! Oh, I wanna talk to you! Uh, sorry, sorry. Jeez, the private areas in this game are a little odd. Is that like a jail or something? Wait, why do we need to pick a lock to get into the lodgings? It's just not open yet. Here. Jeez, sturdy watermelons. Hello, hello. Damn it, she ran away from me. Ah, uh, whoops. People will be up and about by now. Oh, there we go. Hello, lady. Oh, Marta. Hey. Hey. I want to talk to you. Is it open yet? Nope. Watch where you're going. Hello. Vitality, endurance. You get marathon man or sprinter. Thick blooded. Oh, let's get sprinter. Let's run fast already. Hey, hey! You walked. You walked into me. That's a cool shield. Uh, maybe my lady's up and about by now. Maybe the bathhouse is open. Let's just see what this is about. Nope. So what is this private area? Show you my private area. Let's have an apple. Ah, okay. Looks open now. Hello, bathhouse proprietor. Um, you my my like? Jeez, you can just like flat out. Okay. Um, so let's have a bath and launder our garments. Proper bath. 
Oh, no worries. Oh, jeez. But you'll pay in advance. I'm not giving you that much. Uh, um. <laughs> Alright, can I, can I just get a shave? I'd like to see just get a shave. Order or something here. Uh-huh. And what do you... Oh, this is asking us what we want. Uh, the Woodsman's Pride. <laughs> A shave. Uh, Glued more hair on. No, yo. What's we got? The troubadour. Uh, no deal. I just want to shave it. Just, t just take it off. Uh, right, casual no elegance. Hello Zito, how's it going? No deal. I find it very odd that we can hire a wench from the bathhouse. Alright, let's go see if Lady Stephanie is awake yet. Good thing I checked. Be a bit awkward if you get to Ah, oh, you know, hanging out. A bit tired from work today, so not a high energy stream, but nice place to come chill, explore ancient, well, not ancient, I guess, just medieval Hungary. Gotta go see Lady Stephanie. See if she's awake yet. We were sleeping in last time I came here. I mean, I, w I did get there at like five in the morning, so. You up? No, that's a maid. Stephanie! She's still in bed. There's that other girl that I had a chat with and I wooed. Nice, nice and relaxing. Um, it's it's just gone eleven at night here, so it's not really a good time to be. I think don't think I can go in these rooms, can I? Yeah, not mad at me. Maybe she's she here. Oh, oh, hey, 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 hey. Oh, this is a chapel. I think I'm alone in the chapel. And also winter's coming, so the days aren't too warm these days. Ooh. Uh, is there a button to press to pray? Um, I know you're very busy praying and all, but I want to have a chat, so... How do I look? How am I looking? My clothes are clean. I, they're a little torn up, but they're clean. Uh... Hey! You wanted me. The Lord save you. What do you need? I heard you wanted yeah. to talk to me, my lady. Yeah, it's I've only true. played about an hour or two. From you. How can I help? My cousin, young Sophie, is going to be wed. It will be an entry into a new life. Oh, and I jeez. Am I? For her. I'm looking for a few things to give her as a gift, and you're going to find them for me. My lady, but why me? Normally, I'd let the Chamberlain take care of it, but he doesn't have Ooh. any taste. I can't trust him with this. And I've been told no task is too challenging for you. Is that not true? I'll take care of you, Lady Stephanie. It will be my honour, my lady. Oh, God. I need you to pick up an ornamental crown from Sassy uh... and Sophie, wine from a merchant in Ratai, and a roan from the stable in Ujis. Do I have to pay for him, or is she going to give me a Who stipend? To pick up the wine from? From Conrad Hagen in Ratai. He's the only Damn, girl. She can drink. Good wine. 
And believe All right, me, uh, I know what I'm talking about. Here you go. That should be enough. And the ornamental crown? I had the engravers in Sassau make it, but now they've written to say it will take a while longer. That just won't do. The wedding is almost Pick it up and, and put it in my purse. Go and see Master Jeremy Slesky and pick it up. Maybe I should go visit Ujits first, so I just so you can have a horse. Uh, a roan from Ujits. Precisely. It's a beautiful animal. Wait till you see it. Dietrich said he'd ride it here himself, but I can already imagine how he'll end up <laughs> killing himself on that horse. But you, so young and vigorous. Yeah. Who am I right. supposed to pick up the wine from? From Conrad Hagen in Ratai. He's and believe me. Wine, a roan, and a crown. I can handle that. You Thank met me like you. once. I just wish there were others here I could trust <laughs> so well. You're so young and full of stamina. I bet you could ride all night long. The horse, that is, of course. The horse. Uh, Alright, so I've got to go... Jeez, all over the place. Yeah, but I think Ushits should be first, just because... This world map doesn't seem as big as I expected it to be, but I get the feeling that it's going to be. Alright, let's go visit this quest tipster. Because she, she said it's almost upon us, but she didn't, like, say, Hey, you need to do this within two days. So, I'm not in a super rush. I really like that escaping this castle the first time, you can jump off the bridge and they're like, Hey, he jumped off the bridge! Game's full of nice little uh, things like that. Uh, I'm stuck in the bushes. I mean, there was the first time I came into this, I was in there, there was another lady and she was totally got into me as well. I was looking for her just now and couldn't find her. Everybody seems to be into. Did somebody say stop? No. Chill, dude. Will do. Thanks for the uh, uh thanks for the offer. <laughs> He's got a cool hat. Uh let's see what's happening. Oh, I guess that's the tipster. Let's go into the innkeeper. How are the Talmberg folk getting on? Is it peaceful here? Do you even have to ask? I heard from the stonemasons there's been some trouble at the quarry. Hope it doesn't drive them away. They spend a lot here. Alright, what else is happening? I just hope the Divish and his quarry master get it sorted out. Okay. How are the Talmberg folk getting on? Ah, so there's something going on in the quarry, but I think I'll do the horse issue first. I mean, I kind of just want to go find that Dude who stole my sword. That feels like it's the most in line with my character. Explore unexplored place in the set to the southeast. I can follow this path around to the south. This way, I guess. Yeah, that's the path. I assume that's the path. Sort over the bridge. There's a chapel and just some houses. I'm gonna follow this place, this will take me around. Neat little gardens. So no Skyrim where you can just steal from all the plants as you run by. It's me! Hello! I'm not hiding or anything. <laughs> it's funny when they, they get all indignant when they're the ones who run into you. Oh jeez, I almost threw myself in a ditch in the stream. Yeah, I know, but the way he talks about it, he's like, I need to do this, this is the first thing I do. This is like a hunter's lodge. <laughs> I wonder if it's a hunter's lodge. 
I don't take very good care of their skulls here. Oh, we can... Can we... Can we... Oh, um... Zeta, how do I fix up my clothes? Is that something I have to do at the bathhouse? <laughs> Look at his hat. You walked into me, don't get mad at me. With all my clothes, like, beaten up. Uh, for some lessons you'll have to know something already there. I'd like you to show Beginner, me some slightly advanced, advanced, yeah. master, alright, beginner. Do I have to pay? Yeah, of course I do. Oh jeez, like 60 gold. Alright, but it'll cost you. Maybe another time. Yeah, no, that's alright. I'll get into Lady Stephanie's pants first. Um, I don't know, I've got that crappy old sword. What have we got? Pathway. I've got three different pathways, jeez. Okay. Zoom in more? No. So I want to head to the northeast. This way. I do not these woods. This is really cool though, the whole environment shift and there's a ground cover and the sun is shining through it. Oh man, this is such a beautiful game it is. I discovered a nest, did I? Oh, there. Huh. Huh. Ah, oh, damn. Can I, like, chop down the tree? Yes, take that tree. Yeah, I, I figured there'd be like a tailor that I can pay to fix my clothes up. But I just haven't found any yet. Wolves don't bark, they howl, right? Alright. I think in Skyrim this is the point where you'd be ambushed by rats or something. Okay, so it marks a nest on the map. I guess it's important. So there's a, like a a not so nice path that way. I can continue on this way. I love how not every tree looks the same. They all look unique. There's a tree in the middle of the path. Oh, uh. Oh, I'm being ambushed. Oh, I almost got him. Makes me wish I had a bow. Shh. I should probably just stab, shouldn't I? Stabbing's faster than swinging. Is that a 2001 Space Odyssey obelisk? Haha, -ha, he's stuck on a. Oh. I don't, I really don't want to go too far off the path. Oh yeah, what's up with these shrines? Is it just like a shrine to people? Does it have any influence in the game or is it just some names? Let's get high. <laughs> I'm dodging my clothes out there. Like full of holes and 
Helmet's all rusty. Damn it, I didn't notice that here. I didn't forget that I was here. Shh. Ah! Damn it. Alright. So. Oh. Do torches run out? I would assume they do. This one isn't. Alright. Ooh, it's a herd of elk. Or deer or something. Man, they'll just look so many little details in this game. They keep amazing me. We're out of the woods, both literally and metaphorically. What's the what's the point of that? Yeah. Do they affect- I I'm, would assume they affect visibility. Like how likely it is for somebody to see you. Especially at night, of course, but... Alright, I'm following the right path that I am. I guess I could head straight towards it, but nah, let's follow the path. I mean, the paths are there for a reason. I don't know why there's just huge open areas, but... Yeah, I did have two torches and I sold the other one. And I like that there's just like flowers everywhere. I like that there's the perk where if you carry flowers with you, it can make people like you more just because you smell nice. There's so many wildflowers though. Can you. I, I was going to say, can you make potions, but the first. Uh, skill is alchemy, so of course you can make potions. Oh man. Yeah, I'm amazed it took me so long to start playing this game. I guess I was always scared of just getting the, uh, the commitment. I was afraid of the commitment, getting into a, an RPG, a big open world RPG. I see you popping into existence there, Chaos, don't you? Oi. Um, when you say a trophy, you mean a... Achievement, an achievement. Uh, so Just follow this path up and around. I guess there's a field. Those hits. Uh, cool. Hey, what was that? I didn't even read that. Medieval church was in the center. Okay, cool. Nice church in the center of town. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I, I, I've never actually 100%ed achievements. They're, not, they're fun to get, but then I always get so bored trying to get them. I'm just happy that I got the, the gluttony one because I was overstuffed when I got in that fight with the dude who steals your sword and so the like week that you're unconscious it still counted as me being full all right so swap. so this town that I'm in now is its hits but then oh geez oh that's no that's the town itself all right 
And this is just the outskirts. I thought like this little area was the town. Is that a shrine? No. Or is it a signpost? Shrine, cool. Is it... Oh, I don't think this game was crowdfunded, was it? I was thinking maybe the shrines were backer rewards. Get your name in the game! But I don't remember this game being greenlit. What is it? Kickstarted. Hey, you the person I'm looking for? Nope, you're just generic villager. That looks like a nice horse, though. Yeah, it's like with the trading cards. How you get trading cards randomly, but then you can sell them for real money. I mean, they never sell for anything because they're no Bitcoin, but... Are you right there, horse? I hope that's not the horse I've come to get. I think it's a bit. I think that horse is a bit special. I think there's just like just that little bit of body sway when you're standing still too. Oh shit! Oh, training horse riding. Jesus Christ! What did that cost? Sixty. I'd like you to show me how to. Mm. So I'd like to practice them. All right. Maybe what are you spitting at me for? That's <laughs> cool hat. No, I'm looking for them. Good day to you. I'm looking for the local group. Well, you find him. What can I do for you? The lady Stephanie of Townburg sent me. She said you have a road. I ready. knew it. It's the, well, it's the dumb horse. Well, Chamberlain Dietrich said someone would come. We have him here, but if he's ready, I can't say. That miserable horse will let you saddle him. Uh, walk him okay. The courtyard, but as soon as someone sits on him, he goes completely wild. All right. So we have to. That horse is supposed to be presented at a noble woman's Tame wedding. it. Break it. Probably won't be appropriate if he makes a spectacle of his rider. Is there anything I can do? Try asking Vasha. I mean, he just took our word for it that we're from her. Getting an look at what's in the background. He's still, he's still. Um. All right, let's just ask for work, even if we're not wanting it. Any work going here? Enough for a dozen men. You can take the place of that useless stable hand Vashek for a start. What happened? Did he do something wrong? Just found out that he lost our pie. Lost it where? In his stomach? No, no. Pie was our fastest stallion. A lovely dappled one. Oh. Well, that's bad news. How did Vashek manage to lose him? He fell. <laughs> banged his head and the horse bolted. Can you fathom it? I mean, I'll keep an eye out for Pi. a horse. And then Pi took off at a gallop. Well, I can't take Vasek's job, but I can try to find your pie. That would be nice of you. If there's anything you need to know, ask I mean, that fool. I was going to try to go the, like, right. the good route, but then the first quest you get when you wake up is, hey, go dig up a corpse and steal a ring from it. I mean, I haven't done it yet, but it seems like, oh, can I, like, shove you? Shove. Sh shove. Slepnir. Oh, it's just the name of a horse, okay. I'm like, is that the, the Slepnir? I don't remember Slepnir being so special. Um, so, talk to Vashek about this room. I heard you have a way with the horse that unsaddles everyone else. Yes. I suppose I do. And how do you do it? Um. How do you calm him down? I... I'm good to him. Yeah. 
I oh. want to treat the horse. Oh, jeez. But I don't know how, because I don't know him as well as you do. Will you help me? Liar. You want to take him away? Leave him alone. Oh, don't get so aggressive. Okay, okay. Uh... How are you able to handle the horse? I... I'm good to him. Listen, Bashir, Here we go. I've been entrusted by the Lady of Talmberg. I need you to help me understand how to calm down that road. <laughs> Lady Stephanie? Then you know her. She's a good person. She talked to me. Talk to me once? I know her too. She was nice to me as well. Will you help me with the road? You have to... S sing him his favourite song. And which one would that be? Two horses come roaming in the merry month of May To graze in the shade of the apple tree there The first one is brown and the second is grey Which shall I ride to my maiden so fair? That's, uh, interesting. Yeah, uh, let's talk about it. I know how it looks, but he likes it. Thank you, Basha. How's the head? So even strangers know my shape. Yeah, I'm right. I'm, I'm, I'm playing a good guy. I usually play like the super stealth and thieving and everything, so I felt like I'd play a good guy this this time. So what is it you want? I promised the head groom that I'd look so high. Well, good luck with that. I've been so uh. half the day. Although I have been seeing double ever since that bang on the head. So it's possible I missed something. God damn it, Vashnak. Can you describe <laughs> um, long face? <laughs> you did hit your head hard, didn't you? Yes. Why? I asked you to describe Pi. Not every horse in the world. Sorry, he's dappled grey stallion. Gray and stallion, and he's really fast. Though that won't help you much. Quite the opposite. Where did you fall off, Pi? Just south of here, between the fields and the woods, there's a crossroads where four paths meet. It was around there. Four paths. So we could have gone anywhere. Now you see my problem. When was that? In the morning. Oh, he's even got like a scar on his head. As rough as a boar's ass. I was glad to stagger back here in the end. Oh, is it? Oh no, it's just a weird graphic. Fine. I'll go and look for him. Thanks. If you find him, the groom might go easier on me. Oh, and one more thing. Well, I, I think the bridal way is the bridal way. like so I keep the going. path. That's useful. Thanks. We sit to the south where there's a four-way crossroad. I guess it's that. All right, so let's tame this other horse. Where where do you say it was? The north of here, and then we'll ride this horse to go find Pi. Ah, thanks for joining me, Zeta. It's good to have you around. Enjoy your lounging in the sun. Ah, here we go. All right, so we're singing, we're singing his song. Can we sing a song first and then mount? No, I guess we're just getting on. Sing. <laughs> You're definitely the first horse I've ever serenaded. Two horses come roaming in the merry month of May, raised in the shade of the apple tree there. The first one is. Which shall I ride to my maiden so far? Well, are you still gonna throw me off? This way, yes. Okay. Yeah. All right. The 
What's that? That's the one path off. Next one. This one. Just keep an eye out. Some houses. This way, where I might have, and continued on. I ain't got time to follow him around. Yeah. What was that? Wagon wheel. Alright, be good. It's nice hearing the little echo. What's this dog? Hey, dude. How's it going? Top of the morning to you, laddie. Hey, 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 you want to talk to God? That is messing with me. So, boy, ready to sing? Yeah. <laughs> You're definitely the first horse I've ever serenaded. Yeah. Two horses come roaming in the merry month of May. Raised in the shade of the apple tree there The first one is brown and the second is grey Which shall I ride to my maiden so fair? Well, you still gonna throw me off? Um, didn't go this way Or again, maybe he did and Has continued so let's head back, and there's another path over that way, which might. Oh, but I won't turn around. Head east, and then there should be something to the south there. Okay. Yeah. Alright, there should be a path off this way somewhere. Yeah. yeah. Wait here for a second. Ah, you bastard. So you're not you're not my owner. Do one last look. By the way, yeah. oh, oh, oh. bushes in this game are a little odd.
That was interesting because it's just because there's a save point. What's the time? Two in the afternoon. All right, we won't be out much longer, Mr. Roan. It's me. Hey, it's me. Wait, well, I'm not really hiding. Is this somebody's house? Hey, how are you doing? Can I talk there? Mother never. Ah, oh, cool, 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 cool. Dude, we eat whatever comes um, our way. He, he didn't really he say whether the grey had come past. Well, thanks. Oh, cool. Have you seen a horse? Yeah, thank you. Oh, sorry. Hmm. Can you call your right. wife out? I'll ask your wife. I'm, I'm out. Yeah, I want to talk to your wife. Yeah, what are you up to here? Get out of here, or I'll call the guards on you. Is something the matter? What's it to be? Yeah, I want to talk to your wife. Some help? Stomping on your cabbages. Hey, wife. Have you seen a horse running this way? A dappled grey. Which way was he heading? Price. Thank goodness. I was coming with brushwood from the woods, and he almost knocked me down. Just before the farm, at the crossroads. And did you see which way he went? South, along the road towards Neuhart. She's heading south, as in God bless. where we're going. Cool. What is it? This is a nice horse. Huh. Oh. Thing. <laughs> You're definitely the first horse I've ever serenaded. Yeah. The horses come roaming in the merry month of May, to graze in the shade of the apple tree there. The first one is brown and the second is grey. But shall I ride to my maiden so fair? Well, you still gonna throw me off? Hey, buddy. Jesus Christ be praised. Have you seen a horse running loose? A dapple grey? I have, I have indeed. Or at least I did see a riderless horse gallop through here. It went too fast for me to be sure of the color. Where did you see him? A short distance down the road, there's a brook. I was there fetching water. Oh, God. The horse gave me the fright of my life. And where did he run onto? 
Well, he splashed about and then ran upstream into the woods. Much obliged. Oh, that's a little. Good luck in your search. Here we get set up. Jeez, I've been playing for two and a half hours. Um. Alright, the objective is to search for him upstream. Give me a second, give me a second. Upstream. I hope you didn't need your horse clean. Jesus Christ be praised. Have you seen a horse around here? A dapple grey? Certainly have. He ran past here heading upstream. Thistle went after him and hasn't come back yet. Thistle? Mm -hmm. A local charcoal bird. None too smart. We call him Thistle. Right. Well, thank you. To sing. <laughs> You're definitely the first horse I've ever serenaded. The horse has come roaming in the merry month of May. Raising the fruit of the apple tree there. The first one is brown and second is grey. But shall I ride to my maiden so fair? Well, you still gonna throw me off? Oh, let's go. That looks like a grey horse. Where's Thistle? Oh, hey. Must be Thistle. Oh, he does look a bit dopey. Glad to be with you. I'm afraid this horse is a runaway from Little Shit's stable. You can't have it. Fuck off! I don't care where he escaped from. Go find your own horse. You're a thistle, aren't you? Aye. Do I know you? No. But as I was looking for that horse, I came across the charcoal camp, and they spoke of you. And what did they say? Oh, they were laughing at you. They seemed to think you were some <laughs> kind of moron for leaving. Yes, I am your friend. They were laughing at me. Hello, but thistle. Hi. Anytime. Uh, I now see my dilemma. You know what? You know what they say about quick traveling? Uh, nah, that's alright. I can. I find my way. Ignore fish. Ah, uh, he'll be you'll be waiting for me, won't you? For any boy. Uh, thicker woods actually. There we go. We're going yeah. path in a moment. There we go. Easy. What's the time looking like? Let's go three. As long as we make good time, we should be able to get back, and then we should be able to get. Yes! 
back to town by before it gets too late at least. I even catch the lady up. This way, yes. How's it going, buddy? Oh, he's a traitor. I... What is it? It's just that you look like someone who doesn't mind a bit of adventure. And I could use a man like that. It's like this. I know of the whereabouts of some treasure. Well, treasure is a lofty word. Simply um. hidden valuable. And this information I can share with you for a certain price. I don't get it. Why don't you just get the treasure for yourself? That's easy to say. Only it's sure to be buried in some remote place. And the whole countryside is crawling with bandits and all sorts of vermin. I'd rather sell it to you for a few groschen than risk my neck. Sounds a little fishy to me. How do you know about it? I... Uh, well, it's a bit of a long story. My sister married a fellow from Colin, and he was a knacker, so there was hell to pay. Anyway, this fellow's sister... No, wait, that's not it. He was from Kutenberg, not Colin. And he wasn't a knacker, but a bathhouse attendant. All right, all right. I don't need to hear your family's entire I mean, history. I just don't have the money. I've no time for such tall tales. Tall tales? Pah. Go to hell then, doubting Thomas. Mm, okay. What a shame. Look at that, back again already. God be with you. I found pie for you. Dear God! What a relief! Between ourselves, he was none too cheap. I don't know what I'd have done if he was gone for good. Caparison. Yes. Thank you. 80 Groshen. I can go by that map to the treasure now. We'll um. Seen our steeds? Not yet. Is this just horse? Oh my goodness! Had a had a horse. Who's this one? 
Confeca. That's nice. I mean, I do like you, let me, even though you are a daft one. I probably cannot afford a horse. Alright, let's, let's just see how much is left here. I'd like to buy a horse. Well, oh, jeez. I have nothing but the best here. Is there one in particular you fancy? <laughs> Two thousand. Maybe not quite. What about? Maybe some other. I even for that one. That one you can have cheap. He ain't too strong or fat for that man. But he's as loyal as they come. Though. Maybe some other. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go. I'll have to think it over. Find that horse that we left in the middle of the forest. Can we switch between them? Vitality. No, I guess we just can't at all. Marathon man? Ah. We can't switch it over, okay. I have made my choice. So, heading down, we'll come to this crossroad, and one on the right, and the left, and then the weird windy path. Get this horse, deliver it to Lady Stephanie, and then call it for the evening, because it is now midnight, and it feels like I've been playing for about half an hour. A fly. Well, some think maybe there's a body somewhere. I guess not. Let's go hunting. Ah! Oh! <laughs> Fork. Yeah. Head off to the left side. And then around to the left here. Which is a short wander through the woods.
Shouldn't be too far, should it? I mean, I don't know much about the Hungarian woods. I don't know if there are many predators. I might find a bear, actually. Oh, I want to find a bear. I even left him standing in the river. Jeez, must be getting close. Okay. Thank goodness. Hey, Elsie. How are you doing hanging out in the river? Oh, yeah, that's right. I got, I got a thing, didn't I? No, uh, caparison. Whatever the hell that is. Ornamental cape. Distinction and admiration. And fourth, a social status. Cool. It gives a little bit of horse defense. And it gives a bunch of visibility and conspicuousness. Cool. Alright, so raising the shade of the apple tree there. Uh, that's the fastest way, okay. There's a path. Farm is. The way that the buildings in this game are laid out reminds me more of Fallout than of Skyrim. Trust it. Oh, geez. Probably for good reason that I didn't trust it. Yeah! 
All right, what do you got? What do we have? Uh, male koi, 14 armor. We have a male collar. Or a padded black koi, 9. Cool. And the other one. A bandage. Your apple or apples, arrows. Alright, our shard is forty-three. Three thirty-five forty-three two compared to 3142. That shot is better. Where's his bow gone? Did he drop it? Bad mushrooms last forever. That all doesn't last for long, but it's good food. Um, so he must have dropped his bow. Yes, he did. Um, let's see if we can't eat anything. Stores health. Dry mushrooms restores. Cool. I don't know what that symbol means. Healing. Okay. Anything worth taking? Slippers one, breaches one. I'm gonna worry about the mail coif. Is it a mail coif and a padded coif? Equipped. We got a head chain mount and a coif. Let's get a padded coif instead. Oh, Grishin. Jeez, a bunch of Grishin. I probably should check the other guy for that too. But if you just take his gloves, they're worth 200 Gershon. I mean, yeah. No. Let's quickly grab everything that's worth me. Let's be on our way. What are we doing for weight? Hey, we're fine for weight. And pretzel doesn't store any health. Apple, I think, is good for, yeah, health without too much nourishment. Oops, I accidentally ate a mushroom. Alright, let's go, Rune. So, boy, want me to sing? Definitely the first horse I've ever serenaded. Two horses come roaming in the merry month. Raised in the shade of the apple tree there. <laughs> first one is brown and um. the second is grey. Oh, this geez. This will be the crossroads. So where did Pi go? Alright.
That was a lot of bad guys. What are you doing here? I even got the horse killed. Right here. Careful, dude. Right into town. What the? Hello? I guess I fell off. Right. Careful. Don't run straight into the guard, horse. Look at the time. Seven o'clock. I wonder where she is. She's in the kitchen. I mean, where do you want me to write it to? Oh, okay. I just need to ride. A foot further forward. Oh. 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 Uh, so with that, I think I'm gonna do it with the stream for this. That'll do it with the stream for this evening. Jeez, I'm tired. Um, thank you for joining me, and I'll see you in the next one. We're gonna play definitely play more of this. So uh, yeah, catch you around.